What's going on, Internet? Threat or 50s Viking here, joined again with Mr. Corwin for our randomized Zeta and Omicron Solok. How are you doing today, Mr. Corwin? Good yourself? Oh, pretty good. So last time we ended up with uh, getting another pair. Sadly, not a pair that we could use right away, but that kind of is what it is. So I think we're ready to continue forward from here. I'm ready. Let's do this. All right, let's go. Did you battle this guy yet? I have not. I have. <laughs> I have as well. Okay. All right, so again, uh, as we left off last episode, we were talking about possibly going down through the, uh, the cave. We decided to kind of push forward this way and... Okay. Uh, yeah, apparently got somebody talking to me. Uh, have you been in the Midnight Mansion? It's just through the, this cave. They'll say they say it's possessed. Well, gentlemen, Eric, battle my dad. Serious. Hey, this sawbuck. I can't even touch this thing. Switch over to fuzzy. I am not scared of a hitman chain. I'm on. <laughs> Doesn't he have two months? Um, this is devious. Double kick. What? Get it, please. Use water pulse. Too bad. Ow. Use Zorak. You know, Zorak is an interesting one. It's one that I haven't actually used myself in competitive battling yet, though I did get that one from you. Uh, I just never gotten around to using it. Why not? I don't know, he's not really my style. Yeah, not that he's a bad mom or anything, it's just I wouldn't really know what to do with him. Oh yeah, Loki, you got him right after you moved. And you, I wonder if Trade Wednesday him to you. Yeah, um, th for those of you who don't, uh, or don't know what uh, Wonder Trade Wednesday is, is there is a, uh, or there, there's another Poketuber, uh, definitely love to advertise for him, uh, the King Nappy. Great guy, um, and every Wednesday for the longest time he was doing Wonder Trade Wednesday, where he'd invite people to go on, he would trade away a certain bar or certain Pokemon depending on battles from the previous week, uh, and I, I, I recently moved from where I was to another place, I was actually living with Mr. Corwin here, and as funny as it is, the first Wonder Trade Wednesday we did after I moved, I got Corey as my trade partner and got the Pokemon he was giving out that week. No. Not really sure what the chances are there. I'm also running out of potions. I'm probably low on Pokeballs. Oh, there's a bridge over here. Uh, I'm heading to the bridge. I don't know if there's some, two plants on the top. And a door. To the root. And I immediately encounter... Aww! A ponyta? A wand. Uh, so, get myself some berries, orange berries, yes. I'd like to get some citrus berries, because orange berries really don't do much this far into the game now. Well, at least not with the mods we have. Moss berries. Do you want to go through that cave that we passed? Like, I kind of want to go forward to see if we can actually uh, get another encounter first. Okay. Two steps in, then we can. A grown pig. Well, well, well. Are you bumped into our rival? I bumped into whoever the heck this is. Uh, I can't really tell. I don't know something wrong with Oh, Frig, what was the voice that I gave him? That's totally him. Well, well, well. Oh, he has two. Want to guess who already has two gym badges? You have two guesses. The first one doesn't count. That's right, me. Maybe I'll make a gym. These gyms are awful anyways. 
I could live in a mansion and hand out swag badge uh, all day. What am I doing? You, me, let's go. Well, uh, nice and rival battle, I guess. Well, at least he's only got two mons. Oh. <laughs> well. Okay, see, he's got your weakness, too. That's a uh, water type. Next mon is gremlin. Uh -huh. My fifth mod against me is combusting. Leave it, leave it to him to have my mascot <laughs> of all mods. that combustion like immediately. Yep. Water pulse. <laughs> that, that's the whole battle. I'm done. <laughs> Take that, rival Jake. Damn, my swag wound. Just pass. I'll have... I've had enough of you anyways. Yeah. Was it just me or was there a, gla a graphical error there where he walked outside of the building? Yeah, I kind of look like... <gasps> Yay! Of course, now I learned bite. Don't mind my fridge. That's your fridge? That's my fridge. That is a terrifying noise. If you guys can't hear this noise, you are so lucky. <laughs> By the way, not to break the fourth wall, but uh, me and Mr. Corbin were actually in the same place this time. Uh, so, okay, what's wait, on wait. the other side of this? This diglet says a real English word. What? Well, I, I guess it's this Pidgey. Let diglet. Did, did anybody else see that Pidgeotto fly across my screen? That is a terrifying list. Pokemon Center! If I had to describe that noise, I would say, like, like if you had a belt sander, but if instead of sandpaper, it was a chalkboard, and you put a rake on it. Yeah, no, I don't know <laughs> what's wrong with my, uh, with my fridge, but it's been making that noise this week. Oh, oh, there's a mart. Sell me potions. I need super potions. Ooh. Well, this is definitely not an encounter. Not a bad attitude. What's it? Is this the safari zone? What? Um, Are you kidding me? This looks safari-ish, doesn't it? Yep, safari zone. Well, I'm saying we get the sa safari zone encounter. Um, who got last encounter? You did first in the cave. Okay, so this encounter will be yours first. So apparently the currency is called 500, or it's called poke. Going in. 30 fire balls. Oh, it's timed. It's not steps. Oh, interesting. My first encounter is a male Magby. Alright, let's see what I can do here. And first blade of grass I stepped in. Mm, oh, oh. I accidentally threw a ball at it. Don't catch it. Don't catch it. Don't catch it. Don't catch it. Well, I'll have to release that when we get there, because... 
that's an invalid catch. Um, oops. Alright, let's see. So I need a female mod. Yep. Female. Non fire Ooh. type. Gender neutral. Go. I'll take it. Go lurk. Yeah, I've never actually run a goal lurk in anything. Now we can't use this. <laughs> yes, we can. He's yes, rock can. first, isn't he? Yeah. Not ghost first. I don't know if there's like an or like a preferred order to do this here. <gasps> oh no. Oh well, there goes the encounter. Oh really? It fled. Alright, well, I'm gonna run around in here and see what I can find. Oh, Maggie also flood. Yeah, see if there's any items or something in here. Well, I don't have surf. I just encountered another goal lurk. I'm so upset. I'm so upset. I'll be haunted by that golem forever. I really wanted that. Well, it is a ghost type. Uh -huh. Oh, hit Mon Chan. Oh, crazy. That's swing in my head now. Trubbish! Anyway, yeah, I don't care what anyone says. Like, I was running that Trubbish and that Garbodor for the longest time online. I don't care what anyone says. That thing puts in a lot of work. Mind you, I accidentally gave it the wrong ability. Remember that? <laughs> yeah. It's got weak armor, but it works! Yeah, we, um... Me and Corwin do do uh, online battling and everything. Uh, we're currently waiting to uh, find a way, well, currently waiting on a few different things right now. Uh, main thing is trying to get a capture card for a DS so we can actually start doing uploads to, of battles. Uh, now, main thing with that is that, you know, we do have to get a card and everything integrated into a DS, but uh, we do actually have a large amount of competitive Pokemon that we've been using ourselves, uh, training, running around with, um, me and Cor or Mr. Corwin here have actually, uh, done a lot in regards to doubles, surprisingly, because for whatever reason, we're actually, sorry, I got distracted by that man stating things multiple times, but, um, we actually do a lot of doubles battles ourselves with us paired against people, so hopefully down the road, uh, when we get a few more subscribers and everything, we would love to uh, get some get some battles on here against some or, or some fans, if we do get fans. And if we don't get fans, we'll, we'll just do randoms against people as well. Uh, well, or we could actually look at going against uh, a few of the other people that we may have involved in the channel here over time. Uh, maybe we'll be able to get Rad in here for... Where the heck are you? I'm, I'm back in oh, town. Oh, you left. Town around the Yeah, I, I went around the whole place and didn't find any items. I found... Obtained a Pokey gear. What? And there's a cave out here. And there's a bunch of berries. And apparently the woman said that Shaman used to live in this town. Oh, I love Shaman. Ooh, nice and low funny. Oh. Ian, isn't that the Team Rocket leader? Who? Gaiden or whatever? Giovanni? Uh, is that this word? No. No. Okay. It's not, that's not Giovanni at all. I'm out of time remembering his name. Well, that's not how Giovanni spelled, so... I, I couldn't even think of Giovanni. I knew it started with a G, though. This room is, this house is oddly empty. That's... I don't believe it. I'm checking the TV. Ooh, what, 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 where, where, where? Bring into words. The TV, the house at the bottom of town. South, south, south. Whoa! Whoa! That was a... That was Ho-Ho. Yeah, I had a Pidgeot and two Pidgeys fly across my screen earlier. 
Well, this encounter is mine, right? Because you got the one on the Safari Zone first. Yeah. All right, so this is a static mod. It does not matter what gender or typing it is. These Pokemon are locked together. I missed that prompt. So let's try this again. Side more from the words. What gives you the right to disturb me? You know who I am? Yes. Well, it's a TV, so I'm going to assume this is Rotom. Um, so I'm assuming you are correct. So this must be what uh, Cassandra was ma or mentioning to us. Remember, so we should check every TV around. So, uh, Giraffe Rig is my encounter. What do you got here, Mr. Cohen? That's not a Rotom. Changes. What? <laughs> I hate you. I hate you so much. Well. Oh. Um. I don't know if I can, like. I don't know if I can poke this guy. That's what I was thinking. Well, ice resists water, doesn't it? Uh, I believe so. Just gonna throw a great ball at us. So you've got a legendary, so you're just gonna have a higher catch rate than that. Yeah, I know. Okay. Alright, I'm. Okay, it just dropped my attack, so I'm gonna risk it. I'm gonna go for a bite. It's not stab. Yes, it is weak to it, but it's not a stab move for me. Dangerous. Reggie Ice doesn't wear explosion, does it? Don't be saying that shit. What? It's an honest question. Get in the Pokeball and stay there. Hit this thing again. What? He used explosion. So I was right. Uh... Well, yep. There goes our static pair. It's just me. We have like the worst luck trying to catch anything. I think we're lucky we got two. Yeah, at this point. Well, technically we have four mons caught. We just can't use two. use two pairs without altering our teams. So, you know, it could be worse. So, we're actually uh, starting to count or get down on our timer here. We have about four and a half minutes left in the episode. Uh, there's a little cave to the west, of, on the west side of town. You want to check that out? Yeah, that. Oh, right. I have to, um, I have to release that Pokemon I caught by accident. A second. I'll uh, wait out front of the cave. I'm sitting so close to the screen, I feel like I am playing it on the Game Boy. Bye-bye, oops. Sorry, my Dina. You just weren't what we were looking for. So, okay, okay. Left, left, left. I haven't even walked that far into town yet. Oh, no, that's a Pidgeot. That wasn't a hollow. Uh -huh. Poke gear. Oh, Poke gear allows us to bring up our map. Cool. I'm gonna look where we started. Wait, this way. Oh, I went to go in the cave, and it says we shouldn't leave yet. We have things to do in this town. Well, yeah, there's the Pidgeot and two Pidgeotos actually, because they've got a headdress. Interesting. 
Well, we probably need to check out these Team Rocket hideout. What Team Rocket hideout? This one here with the two guys in front of it. They need the museum. Well, that misspelling an artifact. Well, oh. Super awesome rare Pokemon. Now, this could actually be true because it's randomized. Team Asgard Grunt. So I guess we've come to Team Asgard and Olympus, I believe, for yours. Yeah, I got Olympus. You know what? That is a decently rare Pokemon. And I'm... Yeah, really? Throwing <laughs> the top one. Cool. I'm really not liking how weak time is, man. I, I have a feeling like he's just, he's waiting to be lost. This, uh, after the encounter you got going on there, we'll call it for this episode and uh, gear up towards the next one. So I guess we brought, or we finally, try, finally start to find out what Team Olympus and Asgard is up to here in the region. Um, first time we really encountered them, especially in the beginning of the game. So I believe that's all we have here for this uh, or this time. So we're going to be looking at joining you guys again. Uh, here in the next couple of days, anything you want to join or want to add in there, Mr. Corwin? Uh, no. Uh, aside from the new or encounter you got, so I'll yeah, wait for you to get your encounter. I went, I went back to the door and I missed a guy. Oh, dear. Oh, what did the animation on Confusion right there? I never noticed that. Yeah, it looks nice. So with that battle all wrapped up, we're going to wrap up the episode for today. Um, thanks for joining us here on our Let's Play, and we'll see you guys next time at The Threshold.